Okay, you got Cheeky Saver here, and I'm going to explain to you how I did so well <laughs> at Safeway this month. I don't spend a lot at Safeway. This is the most I have spent there in probably a year. Um, I know I do this every month, the prescriptions, because I have full coverage, and it ends up getting me $10 a month, but that's separate from what I've done here. Um, I ended up spending $86 out of pocket. Pre-tax, the reason we give pre-tax total is because it varies from province to province and the only way to measure it correctly is if you give the pre-tax total. So I got the four taco kits, 16 bags of Lay's chips, I know that's outrageous, four 12 packs of Pepsi, four Special K cracker chips, one black diamond cheese it's a 500 gram that's probably about 16 to 17 ounces in the states one four pound container of blueberries for ten dollars one 12 pack of one liter it's about 32 ounces of juice for six dollars and there's always a deposit on those and what I used one coupon. That's all I used, which is crazy for what I'm about to get back, as you're going to see. Only one coupon, and it was out of a student union ticket pack. $5 off when you spend 50 because this was three different transactions. Only one met that $50 criteria. So the perks I got back for El Paso meat coupons when you buy a kit. Four cases of Pepsi, they're worth about $3.99 each. One thing of cheese, that's worth at least five bucks. One $10 gift card for Safeway, I will get back later. Two $20 coupon deals, these are always freebies. And I did two because I had to do it that way with two addresses and deposit on the drinks. And the value of that was two cents away. It was $85.99. I'm just moving this down. There we go. $85.98. Now, I know that most couponers don't count it this way, so we can do it the other way, too. <laughs> and by the way, that's way too many chips for this household. So, like I have here... I am selling them to my daughter's teenage friends. They're all going on a camping trip and I'll sell them up to 10 bags and get $20 back. So I will get that 20 back and then I will get another $10 in credit for the prescriptions. So that's up to 30 plus this 20 equals 50, 60, Sorry, I just had a brain fart. Excuse me. This is 50 right here. These guys. And then 50, so this is 70, 77. And then the $10 as well for the air miles. So that's 87 I get back. Um, plus the free products that I ended up getting. So I did rock star good on this. I am on the Smart Connect site. That's obviously not my picture, which is fine because I don't put my picture up because it's not about me. It's about savings. So yeah, it is totally possible to shop at expensive stores like Safeways and sometimes get some good deals. This was a crazy good month. It is not always like this. And if you want to go and get the Pepsi deal, here's what it is. For every eight bags of Lay's chips you buy, for $20, you end up getting two free packs of Pepsi for free. For every eight bags. So you spend 20, you get the two free, you still end up paying the deposit. And then there's a form that you fill out. I put it on a different um, 
YouTube of mine, you can find it there. And it's printable and you send in your cash register tape. It has to have the full $20 spent on it. Then you send it on in. And when you send it in, they send you that coupon book back. So you, sure you've spent the $20 that is the requirement, but you also got the two free packs of Pepsi and then you get another 20 back. So it is such a win-win in that situation. And the taco kits, I've told you about those. That was a good two weeks ago. That was old El Paso and they were um, $18, but then it's a $10 give back on it with the gift certificate. I sent that in. I have a rule about these kind of things. I cannot bring them back in my house or I will forget to mail them. I don't go by mailing boxes very often, mailboxes. So when I'm doing a deal like this, I take the form in, I have the envelope written up and stamped. Thanks, Bob, for that idea. And I don't let myself go back in my house until those are mailed. It's just that easy. That way I don't forget and they get mailed off the soonest opportunity. Now all I have to do is wait until I get the things in. It can be a while. It's not unheard of for it being two to three months. I can wait. That's okay. When it starts rolling in, it will. There's another deal that I will probably do. It's an air wick. You buy the scented or scent with the holder. It's a starter kit and they will give you a refund on the price. I'll only do one of those because two of those could be tricky. But I'll do that. Um, maybe. It's really late in the game for that one. I don't want to do that that late in the game is what I'm thinking because usually there's a limited amount. I don't know. No, it's not a gift card. Hmm. I'm not sure. I'll have to see on that. I'll think about that. But there are other deals out there with the rebates. And as you can see, in one month, I'm getting $50 worth of stuff back. Plus, the air miles takes it to 60 So it's really easy to do this. And it just requires you planning ahead and having the form ready when you go in the store. Cash register tape straight in and you leave. Now if you're concerned about needing to take items back, don't group all your items together. Run it through as a second item and then what you do is you end up spending the same amount but you um, have your bill just with the items that you're spending. So you're not going to have to take those back, you know that. So you plop it in the mail and there you go, you're off and running. Because you, I wouldn't want to do it on a $200 order and send them this great big long cash tape. That's all I'm saying here. Um, the other thing I ended up getting was on the back of the receipts for this, there's one store I go to that has $5 off when you spend 20 at a Goodwill. Yeah, I got a whole bunch of those coupons too and I didn't even include it. I got four or five. I love those coupons. Um, I'm going to go try a different Goodwill because I find the one that's close to me is fairly expensive. So we'll have to see on that. But these are the deals you can get. Um, it's up to you if you want to put in the effort. If you wonder how I'm getting the deals, I put in the effort and I look for them. My daughter, she finds money all the time, all the time on the ground. And I tell her, do you know why you find the money? And she said, because I look for it. I said, exactly. And it's the same thing with these deals. I find them because I look for them. And I have the time to look for them and just tell you about them so you don't have to look for them as much. And that can save you a great deal of time and just speed up the whole process a great deal. Thanks for tuning in. A long-winded one for me. <laughs> I hope you have a great night. Take care.